Hi, so this is the, the, the end of my journey this morning, but the be beginning of the video. Um, the beginning of the video was very dark because I started running in the dark and with my head torch. Um, but I just wanted to say that I completed the hill run and it was amazing. What an amazing journey. I just love dawn runs. There is something really special I, and something I get about running from dark into daylight. Um, anyway, I hope you have a lovely day and um, I'm ready now after walking the dogs. I'm going to pick up my kettlebell and uh, I'm going to start to work out really hard, I think. So every day something different. Yoga, running, hit training, stretching, breathing, all that kind of thing, but something active every day um, just to boost that energy and um, see what happens as a result of that. So anyway, I'm going to sign off and I'll see you on my next recording. Bye. Morning. It's five to seven on Saturday the 6th of February. I'm about to go on my Dawn Hill run. There's no street lights around where I am because I'm in Vordania. So I'm going to have to run up to Lakshivans and then I'm going to go down through the forest and then uh, to the train station at Vordania and then I'm going to run up that hill, Vordania Hill. If you don't know where I am then you can follow me on Strava after the video. All right, um, I'm going now. Bye. It's 7.15, <laughs> I'm in the forest, it's dark, I'm running by torchlight um, and uh, I'll probably be doing this for about half an hour until I get onto the, back onto the road at Vodan where I can go back up but um, basically it's beautiful, you know I love this time of day, um, I'm just going to turn the torch on. I'm going to record this, bit of water coming down, I'm going to put the torch on it so you can see it better. No, it's not really happening. It's getting lighter though. Um, and uh, I'm going down there. <laughs> okay, that's where I am, as you can see. I'm going to turn my torch off and just show you something. <laughs> you know what, it's so difficult to run on this surface. I don't think I'm going to come up here again until um, it's sorted itself out. <laughs> but it's worth coming up here. I'm going up there now to the road at Vaudagne and, um, and then I'm going to do what I'm here for, which is the hill run. So I'm looking forward to that. Yay. So, hi there me now it's 7 35 i've got to the road there's kind of like a house behind me um the, at the edge of the forest where i've just walked through so peaceful you hear that yeah so i'm gonna i'm just gonna walk down their drive it's basically their driveway that leads to the road uh, and then i'm gonna do my hill run so it's so just a basically hill from the bottom of Vodan or nearly the bottom of Vodania up to the top which is where I am um, I'm not timing myself I would just be really super happy if I could actually get up it you know without stopping so it'll probably be a slow pace which is good um, so yeah I'm going to crack on with it now um, whilst I'm warmed and I'll see you at the top that's what I'm doing running up this road with this amazing view behind me with the village. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hi, it's 7.54. I ran all the way up, wasn't stopping, and actually it was easier than I remember it last time I did it. So I'm so pleased. And uh, yeah, now uh, now I've got to go and uh, walk the dogs. 